What's up, YouTube? This is Chosen Hearts 2. Yeah, returning from our Transformers uh, video view. Yeah, today I'll be reviewing Transformers uh, Beast Hunters mm, uh, la uh, Laserback. Yeah, uh, here he is. It is uh, mo Monster Mode. Yeah, my very first yeah, Beast uh, My very first yeah, Beast Hunters Predacon. Which I'm very proud of. And, it, uh, and uh, these guys I'll, I'll be mostly... Uh, uh, getting focused on when I'm collecting beast hunters because yeah I'm not I'm not a real big fan of the you know, spiky cars of the of the Autobots and uh, yeah that'll turn into yeah I, I, I'll definitely pass on that yeah but, you know, but dragons I dig yeah th uh, this yeah uh, laser bag absolutely fulfills my Mm, explanation how cool these guys are. Yeah, and, uh, and uh, his uh, his monster mode kind of looks like mm, a cockatrice. Uh, a cockatrice is a type of a type of dragon appear up here in Greek mythology. Yeah, that was supposed to be uh, have a head of a head of a uh, head of a chicken, uh, neck and tail of a, of a serpent, uh, a body of a dragon. And you know, bird like feet. Yeah, and. And, of course, has wings. And if you look upon its gaze. If it, uh, yeah, yeah. Just like the Gorgon, it will turn you, it, it will turn you to stone. Yeah, so uh, that's, uh, that's what I think this, uh, this beast mode is is a cockatrice. Uh, an interesting thing is uh, this is also like a, you know, like an update version uh, of this guy, you know, like uh, Flame Feather. Oh, if you compare these two, they are very similar. Yeah, yeah they both have, uh, they both have, you know, uh, both have beaks uh, on his mouth, just like, uh, just like that. Yeah, and also Flame Feather's eyes you know, have a little pupilless, evil looking eyes. Where, yeah, of course, Laserback ha uh, has also. You have these two eyes, very similar. And even even though the feet are similar, even though you know, La Laserback's feet are, are, mo are, are molded, but he does have the little. You know, little bird feet and uh, uh, talons uh, sticking out. Yeah, uh, you know, which matches the back legs of uh, of uh, laser back. Yeah, and also the tail is similar, although he does have a little curry tail. But but uh, but if you remove his tail, uh, it looks uh, very similar. Mm. Mm. You know, two flay feathers tail. Yeah, you know, even even though even though he ha even though he has feathers, he's got laser back of scales. But yeah, very a uh, very the tail is a bit, uh, the same design. Yeah. Also, if you look, uh, also if you look at mm, you know, the uh, the other end, you can see flame feather has you know, has the wheel word. Where the spark was allowed the sparks uh, to uh, the shoot out of his mouth, although mm, although Laserback can't uh, can't shoot fl uh, shoot the uh, sparks like like G One toy, but yeah, he does have a little purple you know, bit where uh, where the wheel uh, would normally be uh, located, uh, as you can see here. And also, he has, you know, has a little gap on his chest. Which messes uh, the gap on Blade Feather. So yeah, that, I think that's what this beast mode is. It's just a, yeah, it, it's just an update version of the of the G1 Firecon. Yeah. Yeah. What 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 surprised me this this mold get, uh, gets repainted it, it, in this, into uh, Flame Feather's uh, G1 colors. Uh, about that, I think that's this this basically what what this is. Uh, or, or update version, 
And I really do love this uh, mo uh, monster design. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I got nice, nice, uh, nice uh, details of its scales. Also, it's got spot like horns. Yeah, uh, which uh, which grease could could mistake that for a uh, for a chicken comb for the cockatrice? Yeah, very like. And also, also all all over him, I just noticed he does have little. Detail of like ash in his toes, like like he's been, like he's a bit a bit into you know, fights. Yeah, he got all scroll all scrapes on on his shoulders. Yeah, very uh, yeah, little, little like uh, di little mix of uh, organic and also a little a little bit of robotic look, especially on the arms and the leg. Yeah, it's got a nice, uh, you know, nice uh, sca uh, scaly looking back cause with spikes going out. Yeah, very, very nicely detailed. And also his feet, his front, le front feet is more, is more dragon-like. And all well, his back feet is more bird-like. Yeah, so similar to what you expect with a cockatrice. Yeah... So yeah, be, uh, very nice. And then, uh, of course, just like his namesake, he just have a, a, a laser back. Yeah, which is his little missile launcher, which... Yeah, with, uh, with some reason, this missile launcher lo uh, looks like Orko to me. I mean, you can, you know, you can make all his eyes, so, you know, the black face, you know, and the purple scarf. No, uh, I mean, the, and the red. I mean, this looks like Arco. Yeah, the trolling cannon. Yeah, and the trolling cannon does shoot out pretty, uh, pretty far distance. And this is kind of, kind of, kind of a a cobra-like missile, which I have no, uh, which uh, pro uh, probably have been used before in, uh, in the G.I. Joe. Uh, retaliation figures, which the, the way the Hasbro does GI Joe nowadays, I would I wouldn't doubt it. Yeah, yeah. Any, anyways, uh, anyways, as far as as far as articulation goes, it, it's very possible. Yeah, his his mouth his mouth can move up and down. Hit, uh, okay, open and close. If you go. Know, Although that's one, one complaint I do have this figure, uh, this character. I just wish the jaws you know, would have been painted. I mean, this let this red, you know, plastic with no paint apps. Uh, that looks dumb. That's what... Yeah, I, that's for yeah, yeah. But paint apps aside, it it does have little sharp teeth. Mm, although the although the red the red teeth that kind I kind of like it kind of looks like blood. He just you know, devoured it. Just got done uh, eating a human. Perhaps, perhaps, you know, perhaps the perhaps the little kids in the show, but yeah, yeah. Anyways, he yeah his like uh, his his head can move up and down. Yeah, his legs could also move. Uh, full legs can uh, can move. Uh, move and can be, uh, bend mm, uh, at the knee. Yeah, his foot can also, his front foot can move up and down and swivel the side to side. Yeah, the back legs can also move from side to side. Mm, uh, bend, uh, uh, and gonna bend the knee just, uh, just that. Mm, yeah, and you can also get bent up. Uh, has an ankle articulation, went up and down, foot's on a ball joint, so you can move, you know, move the side to side, you know, move up and down, and you can move side to side, so, yeah, his tail has some articulation, although it's kind of hammered due to, due to his missile, but yeah, it, does, it can move up and down if you, 
Yeah, it can it can move up and down, just slightly. But, but yeah, but yeah, for yeah, you know, fair, uh, fair, uh, the articulation on on this figure is is excellent. Yeah, now, uh, yeah, now let's just do a little size comparison. Let's bring out the uh, little Thunderdron. Which, believe it or not, uh, mm, uh, Tron is actually bigger. Yeah. Uh, 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 who would have thought? Since he's a very small Voyager. Yeah, any, yeah anyways. Yeah, the Transform, uh, yeah, Thunder, uh, laser back. No, it's very easy. Yeah, first he removes his tail, which will become his weapon in his robot mode. And then so. And so, also remove his back, his missile launcher, which will also become his weapon in robot mode. Yeah, we want to flip, I'll flip this up, fold the tail in. Mm -hmm, uh, just like that. Then you take these. Uh, then you want to push his ankles in. Uh, there's a little gap. Yeah, and a little, ta a little yell tab. You want to push this until gap locks into place. Just like that. Uh, this thing on the side. Then you're uh, then you're gonna collapse these two hips together. Mm, uh, just like that. <sighs> that uh, now, yeah, now you take these arms. To, uh, take these front legs. You wanna, wanna, hey, uh, bend these hand, uh, hands out like that, and twist this arm around. Do the same on the other side. No, push his arm out, fold, uh, fold his beast, won't tell us, flushes to the arm like that. And just push just like that. And yeah, see, this, uh, see, the hands are all hinges, which easily pops off. And the, at least joints are so annoying. Yeah, uh, hey, when I know, uh, hey, when I know, uh, that skirts at him. No, uh, transfer regeneration scourge. Yeah, next, uh, next you just open his chest and take this uh, carc carcatrice head. I'm gonna fold, mm, mm, I'll fold this down. Yeah, uh, until it flushes the chest and just collapse. It's back in. Yeah, then you just for and you push this. Yellow piece. You got the head head revealed. Yeah, and you can possess in these. You know, uh, they can put any spice in you want. I just like to leave, leave them. Yeah, uh, I leave them up like that because it makes them more cool. <sighs> hey, ladies and gentlemen, here you have. Yeah. Yeah, laser back in his uh, robot mode. Hmm. Yeah, which, uh, yeah, which is a very, very cool robot mode. Although, I do have some, uh, you know, couple of nagging nitpicks. Uh, what, uh, especially on the uh, work, most of it is for the arms. Yeah, I see this uh, huge. Now a gap on his arm. You can see inside the hinges. I uh, that's just look ugly. I hate to uh, hate to have a huge gap on his arms. Uh, but uh, although I could, although I could, I could tw uh, twist his ar uh, arm around so they're not so uh, noticeable. But then you know, then you're not gonna have a be able to bend uh, bend up to. Uh, I don't hold a weapon. 
So, not a big fan of this. Huh. But uh, what can do? What can, what what can you do? Uh, also, not a big fan of this big hollow chest thing. I mean, I, I just I, I just wish they would. I just wish they uh, well, what add more plastic to yeah, you know, like make these make these shoulders help uh, uh, tr transform. Uh, like uh, like the, I like the solar transformation could be used to fill up more more of the chest better. No, but like I said, this is of course Hasbro's uh, saving money and top and cutting down costs and all that. Yeah, the foot, uh, bur of course, I'm not a real big fan of these, uh, these feet either, but but uh, but uh, I can't get used to them. You know, you got a lot of um, movie transformers had uh, uh, all chicken legs. Yeah, so that uh, so that's easy to get over. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. While well, the rest of it is, looks very, very, very excellent, and I do, uh, I, I, I do like this face, face head sculpt. Yes. Oh, uh, little Beast Wars uh, type uh, head sculpt. No, mm, uh, with uh, with a. Uh, yeah, with, uh, with like running teeth, you can see. Yeah, you can see his teeth. You can see, yeah, uh, see the nose, and eyes. I, I, I just, my name, my name pick. I just wish to see what if, yeah, 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 do something about the eyes so we could see him more. I mean, this either adds some light piping, which is always very cool, or does uh, paint the eyes so, you know, no, 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 it looks all dead looking. Yeah. For, <laughs> yeah. Also, if yeah, if you're not also the, if also if you're not a big fan of these shoulders, you can all oh, there's a little hinge on the, on this panel right here. We can he can move up, uh, which I do. Uh, which I do like that design. And I uh, gotta give him uh, give him shoulder pads. Uh, differentiate his uh, robot mode as monster mode a bit. Yeah, and that's come with uh, that's come with his little weapon, which you can uh, which you can split this little uh, scale. There's a little soft rubber, but you can peg this. You can split it out like that, and he got his gun. Yeah, why would he split out like that? Well, well because uh, well because it's a toy. That's why. Because he's a Predacon, and Predacons need scary, uh, scary looking guns. <clears throat> There's your answer. Yeah, uh, and of course he also has a, as mm, he could hold his tail like weapon. Yeah, and this uh, uh, I think is a nice little mod to the G1 uh, Shotacons. Yeah, what's that? Uh, yeah, with the shot, with the shark guns, in their mo monster mode had a uh, has a has a spiked tail like a yeah, but but, in, uh, but it can be removed and uh, the, um he can uh, he can use that as a more uh, as a morning star uh, in his robot mode. So this is what what is this nice little monster, do. yeah, and it's a. Uh, yeah, uh, very uh, very cool, and, uh, and I I imagine it's, uh, these Predacons ha having what, what uh, uh, in their characters what would have had like uh, like bizarre uh, looking weapons use one use one uh, use one of their own parts as a weapon, yeah, what, almost like a little more barbaric, no, mm -hmm. yeah, look, uh, looking design. Yeah, and it, yeah, very cool. I, re I really do like, like it. Although I do prefer this his beast mode a, a, a lot better. Yeah, that, that's robot mode. So I'll, I'll keep on his beast mode for the most part. But his robot mode is not, not that bad. And it's you know, do a lot of size comparisons. Compare him next to uh, Thrust. Yeah, what's I do? What's I do? Lie here. 
Blades are back. It is is taller, so so yeah. Uh, well, really, 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 this is a good sign because yeah, this is because uh, now we're starting again, like a more normal looking uh, uh, deluxe figures, uh, uh, deluxe sizes. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, for for a while since like Transformers: Dark of the Moon, yeah, uh, the deluxes have been have been struck down due to the, of course had to reduce them because of cost. But yeah, uh, very nice. They uh, they uh, the deluxe figures are getting back to getting back to their more deluxe sizes. <sighs> yeah. So yeah. Yeah, this is a very awesome creature. Uh, very awesome, and, and definitely, I'm definitely gonna pick up the other Predacons uh, to complete the you know, collection. However, th this uh, mo is not uh, not for you, not for everybody. If you don't, uh, if you're not a real big fan of Beast Transformers, and don't don't get this figure. If you don't like uh, uh, Transformers becoming. Uh, Oh, monsters or mythical animals and all that. Yeah, yeah. Then, uh, uh, uh and pass this figure up. Yeah. Nah. Mm, but, uh, but other than that, it, it, this is a great figure. And you, and you don't have to be, you don't have to be a big fan of, you don't, you don't have to watch, uh, Transformers Prime or, you know, or be a fan of the show who, to like his figures because really really if you uh, really yeah yeah really these, these guys are worth uh, really that's good work. if you don't watch the show these guys are worth worth picking up especially if you if you're a big fan of like the Terracons and the Firecons or even like uh transport some of the you know rare creatures from the Transformers Energon TV shows and all the later uh, so yeah, especially especially if you're a big fan of dragons, yeah. Yeah, that that's pretty much it for my video view for uh, you know, laser back. If you like this video, please throw me a description and thank you for watching. Goodbye.